Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have quite a few different things to go and cover over here, all in regards to the Cyber Monday, all the nice little potential in stores, and line all the other little random various restocks all on going over here on all these platforms. There is going to be a lot of PlayStation 5, I think, attention, more so even in stores, but there's also a few different locations you guys can literally just go and check out and go and buy online and go get some pretty easy and nice stock. So this should be, I think, a pretty good day. This should be a pretty good hopeful week, and if you guys also want me to go and be a little bit on top of any good Cyber Monday deals or any more updates or whatever, let me know. There's been a few, and although I kind of almost want to hear your thoughts really quickly throughout the video, have you guys been enjoying or I even picked up anything good for the Black Friday or Cyber Monday sales just throughout these past few days. Let me know. I haven't really picked up anything myself realistically, but you guys want me to go find some good deals. We do actually have a few Amazon links down below for the best sought after deals that we've been looking at. And also obviously like the PlayStation 5 signups and a few other various things like Target. All that type of stuff, but we're going to go through all the PlayStation 5 restocks as of now, this week, and all the things we're looking for, so make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway, either with Xbox or $500 cash. You get the Twitter and Twitch stream down below in case you guys want to go and fall over there for those bonus entries. We also have the Target on the Amazon links we mentioned, and let's dive into the video. So very first and foremost, I think one of the best ones out here to be on the lookout for, mainly because we have the nice proper confirmation over here is that we do have a proper good GameStop restock. Now, it's got a little bit of a pseudo Cyber Monday slash kind of like just general drop going on, but we do actually have some cool new brand new nifty things going on with this. I think I'll actually have a link for this down below too as well in case you guys would like. I think this should be, I think this link should be working fine, etc. But there actually is a new way. Maybe I'll make a separate video on this too if stock still is kind of going on throughout the day. But basically, GameStop should be having a brand new in-store drop. So as I mentioned, I'll have a link for this as well down below, maybe in the very, very top of the description or in the comment section. But as you guys can kind of go and see, there's a very nifty thing. I may also, like I said, want to make a separate video on it where they do have pickups in stores. Interestingly enough, so if you guys do want to go check out any of this console stock, as you guys can see, they do have, uh, I believe these are used consoles. I'm not actually sure on this one, because uh, they're slightly cheaper. They have like $40 out, $40 off, whatever it may be. I'm not really sure exactly why. I don't think that's the normal console, because most normal consoles are a little bit more. I'm just going to assume that they're uh, like refurbished or like used or trade-in consoles, but... As you guys can kind of go and see, they do actually have these two double whammies right above you, which I guess I'll just, I'll just give you guys a link to the general store in case you guys want to check out and see. But they do have the God of War Ragnarok consoles, the nice little bundles, and then the nice little digital consoles too as well. So like I said, maybe I'll make a separate video just because GameStop's been kind of hot in the news. Uh, if you guys missed it, they've been lying. They've been doing crazy, weird drama. A lot of not good stuff. If you guys missed that video yesterday, go check it out after this. But uh, yeah, basically, if you guys want well, the link down below, this should be confirmed. I'm not sure if it's like a weird Cyber Monday deal. Because it is technically Cyber Monday and then also then like in-store pickup. So I'm not really sure if that counts or not. But if you guys want to check either for just casually going to your local GameStop store... Asking them for stock, getting stock from them. Uh, you're just literally just driving over there for like your lunch break or at 11 when it opens or after work or, you know, just whenever you guys end up going. And if you guys want to go and check out your stock from there, and you guys can go and see how everything kind of goes and flows. So basically do this online order with the link down below, in-store pickup. Or if you guys just want to be just adventurous, just go to drive to your local GameStop stores. We have been seeing a lot of locations just having a bunch of extra stock still sitting around and floating around. For all the lovely folks out there who just, you know, want to go check out some stock. We've even had people up on Reddit saying stuff like this, where GameStop San Diego in North County. Uh, Escondido, <laughs> I probably said that wrong. GameStop has 20 PS5 consoles available for pickup as of an hour ago. Order them online if you have to as well. If you guys want to go creep on these and check them out, you guys totally can. So we've been seeing like the additional restock restock. We've had people having a chance to check the stock out out. This will be linked in the very top of the description, like I mentioned. Maybe we'll make a separate quick video for folks later on throughout the day, and we'll let you guys go and know. But GameStop's looking good in store or online. Looking all very nice, good and dandy. Now, the same thing we've been mentioning up here too a lot has also been on the both Target side. So if you guys want to go creep on Target stores, you guys are 1,000% willing and able to. We have been seeing a lot of folks out here getting their stock, getting their hookup, getting everything when it comes to this one. Let alone with the Amazon things too. Uh, you guys have probably heard me talk about the Amazon drops a bajillion different times. But also, make sure you guys check the Amazon links down below. Go and get your signups and the invitations for Amazon itself. So you guys can go get the hookup, request your invitations. We'll talk a bit more about that in a second. But basically for that one, 
Target's been also looking pretty, pretty good. We showed some of these on these weekends too as well. But if you just want to look, like even right now, use the link down below, the affiliate link or whatever. But like I've shown these on the weekend. Folks are just walking into casual Target, getting their nice casual vibes, asking employees, checking online, getting the app, getting the mobile app or whatever it might be. And then basically you guys can go and, well, check that stuff on out. Target employees have confirmed there's still stocks sitting around. We've been seeing some big batches of stock everywhere. So go check out your local Target stores if you guys want to. Go get some good old stock if you guys want to too. And yeah, it's all around kind of nice. You know, it's kind of good to see. So Target's been looking phenomenal. Probably worth definitely checking throughout this week. Or seeing if you guys can get some easy deals on them too as well. So good stuff on Target. Now the same thing too on the Amazon sites we've been mentioning over here. If you guys want, there's a few different things that we've noted for this. And number one is on the fact that Amazon be looking kind of spicy. So if you guys want to, we have all these individual links. Go and sign up for these. They're all linked down below. So if GameStop first, Target looking good, now Amazon side. We are seeing Amazon getting the hookup. So I think this is for most of these consoles too as well for all these individual waves. And we were kind of expecting this. Uh, as I mentioned before, there's kind of like a little bit of a rumor that's been flowing around over here. But... If you guys want all the individual request links down below or check your emails to see if there's anything over there. But as I mentioned, all these waves on 11 27 2022. This is all confirmed officially on the website itself. So if you just want to get the hookup, you guys want to go get the stock, you guys want to get the consoles, go and check out these good old links. They have this, like I mentioned. So uh, basically, what we've been seeing is a lot of folks have been getting instant invites. Although with a brand new drop, it might be slightly different, uh, more so with like Cyber Monday, Black Friday, etc. That last drop, we saw a lot of folks getting instant invites and some folks are getting out of stocks after a few days. So now we do have another brand new wave now. So <laughs> like I said, these are all linked down below in case you just want to check them out. out. We're seeing the good old stock, new old wave of invites, all this good dandy stuff over here. So whichever one you guys want, like I feel like the God of War Ragnarok one will probably last quite some time. Typically, these like proper, normal, non-bundled consoles do go quicker. I'm sure you guys know. You don't want to, some people just don't want the bundles, just want the nice normal stuff. Pretty easy stuff. Like I think it's kind of a good vibe. So if you guys want to check this on out, I'll link down below. Feel free to rock it on out. You should hopefully have a good time with Amazon itself. This week, this week should be fuck uh, fantastic. So I think be all around a very, very nice to go and see. So yeah, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Now, as you also mentioned too, as well, like with the drop, it's just hopefully people will get the hookup. Now, other various things that kind of go note too, as well, is that uh, Walmart. Now, on the actual Walmart website itself, we still haven't seen too many new consoles. I think Walmart might be a little bit dry throughout this week. So just keep that in mind. Uh, we have been seeing Walmart stock physically in stores. So we do know for a fact, if you guys just casually check your wa local Walmart store, see if they have any stock, hit them on up, try to get the hookup. You'll probably maybe see stock. I think GameStop's been slightly better. I think Target's been slightly better. So use those links down below. Or does the Amazon signups like we mentioned too. So if you guys want to creep on that. But Walmart does look like it did sell out online. Uh, kind of sad to see. Like the website's weird and they don't always keep on showing up the refreshers or whatever. But yeah, they just don't have any stock with it. So Walmart might be a little bit more drier besides on the in store purchases. I mean, they may want to work one in throughout the day or maybe just check either way because they record these videos a little bit earlier and then we're like, you know, release them. Uh, so maybe be on lookout in case they do any Cyber Monday deals, but I think they did already update the Cyber Monday deals over here. Uh, nothing like super crazy good or whatever. It is there if you guys want to creep on it. Like I said, I'll have a few Amazon links down below for the general best sales we've seen, like just for like things maybe you guys would like, like games or whatever, but you know, whatever. I think Walmart's a little bit dry besides up in the in-stores, but we have other options. Like you go to GameStop, Target, Amazon, might be slightly better. Now we also have, and will be probably watching Best Buy. Now I didn't check the website, I'll be honest, because we have a lot of other options. I don't think I have to be that, that on top of it anymore. Now, if I would have missed this like two years ago, I'm sure someone would be like, what are you doing, Scrubbing? what are you doing? Uh, but we have seen a lot of game, uh, Best Buy stores still having stock flowing around. Oh, here's another Target one too, I just want to showcase. Really watching a local Target ask about the PS5s, was I able to get two, one for me and my brother, Website showed zero in stock, just a thought as well. So if you guys just casually check, so a heads up for that one. But we were uh, talking about a decent bit about the PlayStation or GameStop Best Buy. <laughs> We've been talking about this these past few days. So we have been hearing, I mean, number one, if you guys want to be on the lookout in case they do like a total tech drop or like a special online drop or whatever, you know, just casually, you feel free to in case you guys would like. 
But uh, yeah, I think it's all around looking and feeling pretty good in case you guys want any good movement, good extra stock for all this type of stuff. So it should hopefully be pretty good. <laughs> I mean, I like it. Why not? But yeah, Best Buy stores have been hoarding some stock. They do have some stock on site and sitting around. So go check out your local stores. Uh, kind of the same walk-in vibes that we see with Target, GameStop. Where, like, it's there. It might be good. We can kind of see how it kind of flows. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> it's got like a 50-50. You just kind of have to kind of go and see and see the vibe and, you know, all of that. Uh, but yeah, some stores should have stock behind the walls, behind the back rooms, and whatever, etc. And hopefully a lot of that stuff should be going pretty, pretty good. So yeah, so go check online, check your stores, check your stock, check and see how everything kind of goes from there. And hopefully it'll turn out pretty good. Or we'll look online if we see more online updates, we'll give you guys a heads up uh, throughout the week. But all around, I think this Cyber Monday so far has been going pretty good. There hasn't been any crazy big deals from like GameStop, Target, etc. There's something, I mean, besides the Amazon links we mentioned too. So we'll, we'll maybe let you guys know if we see better stock throughout these next few days just to see how everything kind of goes. But that's not been anything super nice, super big. But that's pretty much it for all the big boy retailers too. Like I said, Amazon links, Target links, all that stuff down below. GameStop too. Check that out. Now for some other little various things is we still have been seeing the PlayStation Direct still having stock. So if any of you guys do want to go check out the PlayStation Direct for the easy checkouts, I mean, I kind of you could probably just literally go to GameStop and pick it up the same day. I mean, if you guys want. <laughs> but basically, we have still been seeing the PlayStation Directs having stock, and they have the God of War Ragnarok bundles, as you guys can go and see with this. Both the digitals still for sale, somehow. The normal consoles, like these ones, did somehow sell out, though. Uh, but yeah, they still have God of War all of Ragnarok bundles for the disc editions and digital. So check in the PlayStation Direct. They've been good, good source. It's literally PlayStation itself, so I don't know what else you really need to go and do for trust or whatever. But it does look and seem pretty good. So check that stuff out in case you guys would like. And you guys can hopefully go get some good movement and good stock from all of that. So big thumbs up, and I love to go and see it at the end of the day. Good stuff, good stuff. Now, uh, for other little side things too, don't forget we are kind of overdue for a lot of the locations. So number one, Anton Lime. Anton Lime still actually has some pretty good bundles all over here. Uh, they do have a digital bundle for 590 bucks. So the God of War Ragnarok digital, I mean, probably just say PS Direct or Amazon or GameStop instead, but just in case, they do have the digital over here for an extra 30 bucks. You get the little headset, not the best, not the worst, but why not? They also do have the, uh, all their two bundles. They have a God of War Ragnarok bundle and the wireless controller over there. You guys want that, like not a bad deal. Maybe a friend's family over or whatever. Not bad. Also have the Horizon Forbidden West console too as well for slightly higher, but also does include God of War. So if you just want to pick up a bunch of games, it may not be the world's worst bundle. We have also still been seeing Myers, Fred Myers, Kroger's, and Smith stores and BJ's wholesalers. We did hear some rumors that they had some Black Friday stock and weekend stock, and it's kind of been ongoing and rolling. So if you want to check in those locations, feel free to any stock movement and hopefully get some hookups from all of them, just in case you guys would like. Now, for some other little various stock, too, as well, uh, besides on their online or on their apps or checking all that stuff or just calling their stores or just showing up there in their little tech centers and asking, we still are very overdue for Costco in these early mornings. We'll be watching maybe throughout today and all the other various Cyber Monday days, next, next few days or whatever for it, if you guys want to. So Costco, very overdue. Maybe some in-stores rumors have been flown around. Sam's Club also very much on the overdue side. It's been around like three, four weeks now, but with Walmart just doing a big drop, we'll see how they get allocated more stock. PC Richards and Endorma are both very much on the overdue side for any online bundles. If you just want to check those on out. Same with Dell. I mean, they might do it just for the holidays. Same thing too, guys. Don't forget about the Staples in stores too, or their online in store pickups. We've even seen some folks with that. New Egg very much on the overdue. You'd overdue either for shuffles or other various stocks. Also keep that in mind. And then same thing, too, with all these other mid-tier spots, such as the Military Online, Military Exchange Depots, and all of that good stuff on their sites. And of well, we've still been seeing Verizon stores having occasional stock either on their apps, online for checkouts for Verizon customers, or in their stores themselves. HEBs are overdue, Belks are overdue, and like just I'm sure like we have some big priority targets more on like you know all the things we mentioned, like GameStop, like PlayStation Direct, or whatever. So the mid-tier bundles and side spots aren't the best, but at least there are options out there. So, as I mentioned, go and check out the stuff in the, <laughs> the videos themselves. If we see more good Cyber Monday deals, we'll let you guys know on the channel, on a community post, or up on Twitter. And as well, just thank you guys always so much for watching. I think a lot of folks have been getting consoles too, and life's been going pretty good. So I love seeing this. So make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on. As well for the brand new PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, or PlayStation or $500 cash giveaway and also use the twitter and twitch room down below for the follow which for the bonus entries in case you guys would like we also do have the uh like you know amazon links gamestop links we have target links we got all the casual links down below 
I guess you guys want to wrap those on out. Leave a like if you guys want to, and I'll see you guys up throughout this week for a lot of good videos. And I love you guys all so much for watching here over here.